hello everyone so today I am going to add another blend space another blend tree for in cover mechanism so when my character is go into this cover into a cover uh, this blend space will be used instead of the word of the method we had previously so here is the demonstration can move and go to the cover like this so still it can't move go to left or right uh, while it is in the cover uh, that is the next part today I'm going to do this part and this episode is sponsored by these generous patrons thank you very much for the support you guys are giving me right so to implement in cover blend tree I need uh, moving on cover animations as well so let's see A suitable animation for that okay I need I definitely need the cover idle and also I'll download this uh, stand to cover as well without the skin I maybe need that so for the in cover moment I'll download this one crouched a snake in left and crouched a snake in right but uh, what about the animations I already have let's see the crouched animation I mean Let's download this, not this one, this one. Crouch is sneaking left in place and crouch is sneaking right in place. And also a stand to cover I have cover to stand also I need okay let's import this into our project to stand and stand to cover okay under rig I'll choose humanoid copy from the avatar Right, we could cover it like this. Okay. All right, now we have this animator. Right, uh, let's add another state.
and the plane tree and I'll name this one as in cover here I'll use a 1D blend space and I'll add two motions sorry three motions like this first one would be no the middle one would be cover idle like this and this one would be snake left and the next one would be snake right Okay, now I'll uh, set the threshold of this one to minus one, and this is to zero, and this is to one. If I set minus one, oh, I can't set, all right. So this would be then zero, and this would be one, this would be two. Also, uh, now if I change it like this, you can see the directions are changing. So, to fix that, I'll rotate, I'll add the rotation of set 180 to both the snake left and the snake right. Okay, now here maybe I will have to change the animations this is left why is it so so oh sorry oh this is a speed no, that's not the way I want it. I need to set the threshold to be able to change them. Right, this should be zero. Oh, can I have minus one? Yeah. Now I can have this should be one and this is zero and the other one should be one. All right. Now let's see. This is move left with minus one and this is move right with plus one. Okay, now here let's add uh, from any state. No, it should be walking. From these two states, uh, here I'll add another parameter, a boolean parameter. Let's call it um, in cover. Or should be simple. If in cover is true, it should go to this state. I 
here also if in cover is true it should go to this state otherwise it should uh, if the in cover is false it should go back it would be enough to move to this state so accordingly it will go here or here whatever the other state right now this part is done let's go to the script and do the necessary changes character animation cover now here I'll cover any dot set no not cover any animator dot set pool in cover true all right now let's see what happens expected okay uh, let's try again okay oh wait why does it stand Did I save? What is it? Come back. Let's see. Oh, sorry this should be false right that's the case okay now it's all right but uh, we still we can't properly move in the cover because our character is trying to rotate uh, trying to orient itself towards the moment so therefore it will be wrong like this see that's wrong so but uh, I will fix it in the next episode for now I'll enable looping for these animations they should be looped this one And this one and also the cover less well right so I'll stop this episode at this point so if you would like to support my work you can get the membership my patron club the link would be in the description below and thanks for watching see you in the next episode goodbye